everybody, I'm here with Mickey Moo. Hello, Mickey. Hello, Karen. Mickey, Hello, what buddy. have you done? You've given me some pictures of some different yeah. kinds of taxis. What are they called? They're called... What, what are they uh, called? Ele Electrobats. Electrobats. Bats, that's the one. I mean, I don't understand why they couldn't have been called electric cars or electro cars. But we've got the picture up of this lady sitting in this pod thing with the man sitting behind. It's like a little tiny weenie weeny lorry or something. I don't know. It's got big wheels at the front and little wheels at the back. They didn't all, they weren't all the shape. Some of them had the same size wheels. But for this certain period, at the end of the 1800s, in New York and other places, they had these taxis. I mean, they look strange, don't they? Yeah. And like we said, didn't we, before we came on here, that it looked like that, you know, if they went around a corner, they might fall over or something. <laughs> So basically, I'm going to put it back to the beginning of the video now and put the video on. So what happened then, Mickey? You, because I'd done a video the other day, didn't I, in New York? Yeah. And it's, uh, yeah, when you said uh, New York, seeing, seeing New York. And mm. you wondered, what, you know, what, shouldn't it be seeing tour in New York? And I thought I'd jump on it. I thought something's happening here. So when I went on it, I sort of noticed that, ah, I'm just stopping it here, at this picture here. There's a man sitting at the back, got the big wheel at the front, little wheel at the back, and then a little cab in the front. They look like carriages, and they've just amended them. Yeah. The only thing that's missing are the horses. It's thing, yeah. Each one of them sort of come up and they weren't very way. big, were they? Maybe get two people in one, Yeah, two people. We looked Twice it up. This company had loads of them for one year and then they changed their whole stock. That just seems incredible that they would do that. But anyways, put the video on. But they just look so weird. I've never yeah. seen this before. I don't think I've ever noticed this Me before. Neither. Neither. There's loads of things we haven't noticed. But let's put the video back on. So, yeah. So... Some of them were slightly different, but the basic shape was there was a man sitting behind and then you're in front with the big wheels. That one's quite a good one. I'm going to stop that one there. That one's, that one's more like a car, that one, I suppose. That guy's sitting in the front, so it's more like a carriage in the back. But, you know, we've already done this. They're saying it all starts in, in this video that it starts in the 1800s, probably get back to the 1860s, but we have found it back to the 1760s, yeah. and if it goes back to that, it probably goes back further. And what our feeling is, in some of these really old pictures that we're looking at, that there is no such thing as League of Gentlemen, but it's like there was them, they were rich, top hats, nicely yeah. dressed, nice buildings, all the buildings in New York came. And I would put those taxis, which they're saying are the late 1800s, I reckon those ones would have been the League of Gentlemen ones. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But you can't tell if any of yeah, this is are. real, because these things keep turning up. I mean, that one's like a ambulance and looks like a hearse. But suddenly now, these, these funny taxis. And that's, yeah. that's one of them. Uh... New York Electric Taxi and Charging Station, 1896. And that's on one of those cabs, I think. But it's just like a history. Why, why wasn't this here before? They just keep appearing, all these new pictures of things. I mean, lately I've said, oh, I didn't know that that was there. It kind of shocks you because you don't know anything about it. It shocked me when I saw it. You've never seen it. Yeah, especially as in that video with the sightseeing, it was actually the people who were taking the people, the sight with the signs with the sightseeing on, those were the cars that were out, the taxis. Mm. Yeah, the taxis were out. Oh, it's all crazy, I just find it all crazy. There wasn't many actually cars, people didn't have many cars. There was a lot of electric taxis. So that's what you think then? Seems to be. Because, uh, yeah. Funny enough, there was 
Do you think these are real? Or do you think they've just been put in our history to make it up again? Well, I've never heard of an electro bat. I'm sure if I said it to my parents, they wouldn't know what it was either. I bet you nobody really knows about what this is. And anyway, all the people from this time are all dead now, so you wouldn't be able to ask them anyway. Anyway, we, we, Mickey brought to me my attention today to this electro bat, and so we're just putting it in some pictures and showing you the electro bat. Um, obviously, the history they're showing starts in the mid 18 well 1881. I just saw there, so that's not true. It was earlier than this. Earlier, yeah. And anything that looks really old probably did come from earlier. I mean, the, the wheels look too good on these things. There it is. La Autocab. That was pre-war. They're just weird. I, I've never... Never, never, never seen anything like it in my life. Because if I had, I would have reported it earlier on, Mickey. <laughs> anyway, thanks for that, because it was just something that you watched in the video, made you look things up, and then you came across this. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, that one there, we talked about that, the Russian one, and it looks oh, like yeah, a steam yeah. engine, even though that is a taxi. Isn't it? But it's a steam yeah. engine, isn't it, almost? Obviously it's electric, it's not a steam engine, but it's like, yeah. a, it's like a third of a cab, of a, of a, of a tram or something. Tram, yeah. That's what that looks like. Yeah. They've used a third of a tram, stuck wheels on it, made it look That's a bit it. more like... A steam engine. I mean, down here, the driver is sitting in the front of these cabs now and then. Yeah. So they obviously moved them to the front afterwards. Maybe it was easier on the smaller wheel. But all the ones with the people sitting behind the, the electric... What was it? Electro... Bats. Bats. I've never heard of them before. Yeah. So, thanks for bringing that to us. There's another one there. Look at that. They look like great big coffins with a top on. I don't know. It's like the front of a train. I don't know what it is. It just looks so weird. It's like an amalgamation of everything stuck in this little thing. Good word. Amalgamation. Good word. Isn't it, though? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Well, we've only got um, another minute on this video, you know, like, to play. But um, thank you very much for bringing yeah. this to my attention, Mickey. No problem. No problem, okay. Weird. Do you think they were real or not? Hmm. Well, they're messing with the, the past, aren't they? I'm trying to put it in the history of the libraries. They look it up, see it, believe it. We definitely had a huge, great electro, like that one, for instance. Like, yeah. me and Artis did a video where we found loads and loads of these, all showing electric cars and vans mm -hmm. and lorries. Mm -hmm. They, I said to you, didn't I, Mickey? They could go up to 100 miles an hour. They had... I can't remember how long the charge was, but at the moment it's 250-odd miles, isn't it, the cars they're doing today? This would have been double it. And these things could get to nearly 100 miles an hour. And we're talking pre-1900. And then they destroyed it all to bring it back. And they haven't, you see, I think today if electric cars held a charge for 500 miles, more people would buy them, but at 250, yeah. nah. Yeah. Trying to close the lands in, I'd be happy. I'd, if we got one, say, I'd be going, oh, Mickey, I forgot to charge the car. <laughs> no, because it's electric, isn't it? It's not a battery. Uh, Mickey, it's not a battery, it's electric. I anyway. Know. We so found is. hundreds of these. Oh, my They've probably removed them off the internet now, but we found loads. We did a video, I don't know, about five or six years ago about it. Where artists found all these pictures. But we'll never know if any of it's real or not. Yeah. The big electric cars. So, supposedly starting in 1895, but probably 1795, they mean. Probably early, can Yeah. But we've still got cannons. We're just coming out of cannons at this point. 
Um, anyway, thanks very much for that, Mickey. I say the electric vehicle company. There's another one there. So they were really going for it in those days, and then they ruined it. They love ruining it, don't they? So basically, the last picture on the video is that you could go to certain roads. There's Broadway, and you could charge your car up then. But we can't tell if any of this is real, but we just found some photographs and thought we'd put them in. Cool. Thank you, Mickey. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, everybody. Thanks, everybody.